sweet. Turns out that application that I found on here actually can upload those videos straight from the recording process straight to YouTube. Nice. So basically what I'll be doing from now on is um, I'll be using this process to make like vlogs and stuff like that to tell you guys like what the heck's going on so that I won't have to do like editing stuff to it. Um, and I'll also use this method for doing my book review ones. I'm sorry I keep licking my lips. It's just I have a canker sore in my mouth. It's not, that's nothing bad. It's just I'm prone to canker sores. I've always been like that ever since I was a little kid. But, um, let's get on to, well, what I want to say in this video. And it's not that. Uh, you see, I have a bit of a problem. I have too many My Little Pony books. Yeah, they've been kind of stacking themselves up. So, we kind of have to get through these. So, get ready for quite a few of these little mini videos to do with different My Little Pony books. And, well, I'm going to show you guys the books and then each episode will be going through another book as you see it. So, this is another episode of Strip Fresh New from Twilight Sparkles Library. Um, okay, the books I have here are Twilight Sparkles, uh, Twilight Sparkly Sleepover Surprise. And yes, this is actually a, um, I'm currently right in the middle of reading this. It's a MLP uh, bookmark that I have. I got it from Chapters in um, the Mall over here. It's a nice bookmark. It's got a nice little yellow tassel, a little heart on it. Very cute. So yeah, I have that book. I'm currently reading it, so that one you guys can look forward to getting a update, like a episode about that one once I finish it. I also have here um, Starlight Glimmer and the Secret Suite. I hope it's not the suite that Princess Luna and Princess Celestia go out to lock some guards in. What am I talking about? I don't know. Like I said, I'm kind of still sick. I my comedy is not that good right now. Uh, I'm just trying to grasp jokes here. I also have here the Wonderbolts uh, Academy Handbook. And this book is completely and utterly graffiti on by Rainbow Dash. And like, like, I'll get into the, the graffiti stuff in here. Uh, graffiti is not a good thing to do. Don't do it. In fact, my uncle ended up getting uh, in trouble because he was caught doing graffiti. So it's not a good thing. Um, don't graffiti stuff. So yeah, we'll be covering that book in one of the episodes. Uh, in today's episode, though, I'd like to cover um, this book. Meet Starlight Glimmer. And that's the one I want to cover today. Because we should have some more time still to do one of the reviews, <laughs> like I think. Uh, we also have here School Spirit. Now the thing is, people, when I say I have a lot of books, I mean I have a metric butt-ton of these books. I have everything from music books, to pop-up books, to art books, light-up books. You name it, we've got it downstairs. So we got a lot of books to go through. So we have this one here, School Spirit. And we got some new ones that just recently came out, too. These are actually the books I was picking up when I blacked out at freaking chapters. I know, right? I had this one, Wonder Colts Forever, which is actually the diary of um, Princess Celestia and Princess Luna back when they were um, when they were teenagers at Candlelight High, or should I say Principal Celestia and Vice Principal Cel Luna. And... Um, like, I'm really sorry about that. I I have a lot of... Uh, my stomach's still doing wonderful things. And, um... Yeah. Um, and then the other book, which we'll, I'm hoping to keep for a update for... Uh, yeah, Halloween! Yeah, this is a good book for Halloween! If you could see my brain right now, you'd see a hamster stuck on the wheel. Or a hamster eating its own butt on the wheel. 
or a hamster just asleep on a wheel, or a bird on the wheel. Something on the wheel that doesn't do anything with the wheel. That's what you'd see. Can't put two and two together right now. Like I said before, don't get this virus. It sucks. Makes you really, 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 really like. I don't want to say dumb. Because I don't like saying those kinds of mean things. But makes you really like. Let's just say I was sitting downstairs for at least 20 minutes trying to figure out whether or not a My Little Pony book went in sideways or upwards. Yeah. It wasn't pretty. It was really sad. <laughs> but the last book we have, and this one I'm trying, I'm going to be hopefully uh, saving for uh, Valentine's Day, we have Crystal Heart Kisses. It's a baby! With a real baby and her shiny and her cutie nest and her trust with the uncles and uncles and uncles and uncles. Look up your tears. That's her daddy's snout. <laughs> Kiss Shining Armor's nose, every pony. Every brony. Now, if, now I'm gonna call you guys every brony. Instead of people. Like, I know you guys are people, but everybody has, like, their own kind of, like, name for the people. For their subscribers. I'm gonna call you guys. Tell me which one you think is best. Okay, I like the brony, brony herd or something like that. You know what? Actually, you guys come up with the I what I should call you guys, and then vote vote for it in the comments below. I'd like to see what you guys, what you guys come up with. Cause right now my brain is mush. So yeah, um, like I was saying, this is adorable. And it actually has some special surprises in it. And I was pointing at Shining Armor's ass when I said that. No, Shining Armor's ass does not have special surprises in it. Ugh. Okay, getting on with the thing. Like I said, in this episode we're going to be covering Meet Starlight Glimmer. This is one of those reading books. Duh! This is one of those passport to reading books. I have a passport. It's interesting. <laughs> I am so freaking dumb right now. Uh, but yeah, it's basically, um, it's one of those beginner reading books. You can get through it in like five seconds. It's extremely easy to read. It's like Starlight Glimmer is a new unicorn in Ponyville. She learns about magic from Twilight Sparkle. No, really? Thought she learned about how to get her butt waxed. See, it's it's just a beautiful book that basically covers everything that, well, that ever had to do with uh, Starlight Glimmer. And it's, yeah, see, it has, like, a sunburst in it. And some ponies staring at his ass. <laughs> and, yeah... It's got, it almost has, like, broken English in it, like, like, Starlight gets to see Sunburst today. She is excited, but she is also nervous. Starlight and Sunburst are both shy. They do not talk at first. Sunlight, Starlight uses her magic to help Sunburst. They are not shy anymore. It's kind of like, almost broken English, but it's, it's English. Or else why would they let a bunch of preschoolers read it? <laughs> it's a good book. It's cute. Um, I personally call Starlight Glimmer and Sunburst uh, Sunlight because they're cute together. But yeah, that's basically what this book is. It covers like basically anything to do with Starlight Glimmer from the time that she stole the cutie marks all the way to when she became friends with Trixie. So it's a, it's a good book. So yeah. Um, that's what was in today's episode. Stay tuned for the next episode where my brain will implode. It's a must-see episode. I'm gonna go smash my head against the wall. See you guys next time. Don't smash your head against the wall. It hurts. I smashed my head against the, one of the beams holding up the house in the basement the other day. The weird thing is it didn't hurt. What does that mean? <laughs>